Hello, I'm Joe Wren. Indiana is moving forward early to the next stage of its plan to relax COVID-19 restrictions. Stage three will now begin Friday for all but three counties statewide. That next stage allows gyms, community pools, campgrounds, playgrounds, and tennis and basketball courts to open within social distancing restrictions and sanitation guidelines. If you are 65 and older, or if you have underlying health conditions, we're still telling you to be uber cautious. Stage three also allows gatherings of up to 100 people, which officials say should be outdoors. Lake Marion and Cass counties cannot begin stage three until June 1st. Now, other counties are following their own timeline, like Monroe County's current order that goes into at least May 31st. Well, there's been a new shakeup in the Republican race for the Indiana Attorney General nomination. Former Secretary of State and Congressman Todd Rokita announced his bid today. Rokita served eight years as Secretary of State before becoming a four-term congressman. He left his seat in 2018 for an unsuccessful Senate bid. In a statement, Rokita says while normally he wouldn't run against a Republican incumbent, he calls the current AG Curtis Hill wounded. The state Supreme Court suspended Hill's law license last week after it determined he criminally battered four women. And Indiana University has reported record high summer enrollment amid the current global pandemic. Across the university's campuses, more than 33,000 people have enrolled in summer classes. That's up about nearly 6%. The Bloomington campus reporting a 22% increase from last year's enrollment. Officials say they think interrupted plans by the pandemic could have led to students to enroll in more classes. Now here's a quick check of the forecast tonight. Mostly cloudy, lows down to 52 degrees. In the five-day forecast tomorrow, 66 and cloudy, 74 Friday. More rain on Saturday, highs up to 80.